Thank you, Mark. Is it a new sign of the times? A growing number of gas stations are now offering a discount to consumers if they buy their fuel with cash. But is this a good way to go? For some answers, we turn to Five on Your Side troubleshooter Joe Paganak as he joins us live now. And Joe, consumers could save up to a dollar on a fill-up? Yeah, that's right, Lee. And it's all because gas stations are trying to avoid credit card or debit card processing fees. Fees smaller gas stations say are cutting their tiny profit margins down to nothing. I can't sell gas for below cost. I'll go out of business. Mark Rako is in a fight to keep his Painesville gas station open. He says growing credit card fees are killing him. If somebody puts a credit card into my pump, I'm losing approximately 12 cents a gallon today. Like all other gas station owners, Rako pays about 3% in credit card fees for every dollar sold at the pumps, reducing his profit per gallon to just 2 cents. But some stations are fighting back, offering a cash price discount. The customer saves a little bit of money. And it actually saves us money. Easy shop owner Chris Forrest has been offering a cash discount at his Cleveland gas station for several weeks. Consumers are saving six cents a gallon if they're willing to take the time to walk into his store and pay with cash. Credit card fees can continually go up, and guys like us, you know, we really can't continue to absorb them anymore. So I figured. Why not give people a discount for paying with cash? Forrest says more than 50% of his customers are now using greenbacks instead of plastic. In fact, some Ohio gas stations have completely banned credit or debit card gasoline sales. Forrest says it's the only way some gas stations can survive. It's just tough. I would have no problem with that. We thought about going to that, but we do such a large credit card business, it just would never work for us. Meanwhile, some consumers are enjoying the cash discount option. If you pass on a little savings to the consumer, it keeps the little guy in business. I think it's a great idea. You swap your car, period, taking money, so I'd rather spend cash any day. You like the option? Cash. I love it. The National Retail Federation is responding, working in Washington to try to get credit card companies to reduce fees, especially for gas stations. The Federation believes credit card companies should not make a windfall profit simply because gas prices are on the rise. On your side, I'm troubleshooter Joe Paganakis.